Hey, this is Sean with Samson Racing Communications. I wanted to show you the whole mount push to talk and the bracket that comes in a kit and show you how you actually put it together and why we feel this is a much more effective way than, than drilling out the spoke on your steering wheel. So this is a standard coil cord setup with a whole mount push to talk and the bracket that comes in the kit. Here's the bracket itself as it comes. And this is the way you actually install it on your steering wheel. So you take you drill two small holes with 3 8 drill bit and you mount the bracket and your push to talk effectively goes onto your steering wheel. So as you're driving the car, your push to talk's right here. It's easy to touch, it's easy to get to. You don't have to reach over here and you don't have to worry about the Velcro piece sliding back and forth. So this is actually off of our race car, this is our setup. There's actually, if you look here, you'll see that there's a, an extra 3 uh, 3 hole drill with a zip tie. That takes the strain of the coil cord and keeps it on there and not pulling on the back of the push to talk. So you have a loop here, your strain is here, it pulls it away from, keeps it from pulling on the actual back of the PTT button, which is a silicone filled unit, and here's what the back of the bracket actually looks like. Nylon aircraft nuts, uh, Allen wrench on the front, solid, easy, nice easy mount. Make sure you leave enough room when you do this install between here so that when your hand is on the string, oops, when your hand's on the steering wheel, your hand has plenty of room to go by this and not get tra trapped in between the button and the steering wheel. But that's a standard setup. That keeps it safe, easy. It's a nice, clean application. We have boxes of these. There's nylon, there's the nuts, here's the nylon, and here's the brackets, and those go into every kit that's sold with the whole mount push-to-talk bracket.